This just arrived from UPS a few minutes ago. It's a Lenovo Yoga 7i Aura Edition. Comes with one terabyte of storage, 16 gigabytes of RAM. Windows 11 Pro, this is the higher end SKU. So let's just open it up and see what's inside. This is the power supply. It's a bit of a puzzle to figure out how to open it. Nah, whatever. And here's the unit itself. in there put that aside put this aside this aside and Lenovo Aura Edition imagined with Intel and a handy quick reference guide yeah and then the notebook I had the Lenovo Snapdragon notebook a few months ago, but it had compatibility issues with um, some software, so I returned it. But it was a beautiful notebook, carbon neutral certified. Some places you got to pay for that. I, I didn't pay for that. I hope I didn't pay for it. And then don't eat the notebook. It's good advice. And it says, uh, don't look at the screen. Excessive use may cause damage to your vision. So don't eat the notebook. Don't look at the screen. Yeah. And I, oh, there we go there. Okay, the power supply, it's pretty small. It's pretty small. And it comes with a cable, of course. Now there is another Lenovo 65 watt USB-C GAN adapter. This is its size. You can get these on sale for $30 from Lenovo. That's about half the size of the adapter. This comes with the notebook. So it'd be nice if Lenovo included this. Maybe next time. Okay, let's open it up. Um, doesn't open up. You get a oh, it's a glossy screen. Plastic-free packaging. Worry-free planet. Power connector. Nice. And then we have this Lenovo services. I think this is part of the Aura edition. You push a button, and someone from Lenovo will help you out. Anyway, here's the notebook. Let's try the typing. Oh, that's nice. That's really nice. I haven't even turned it on. Again, you're not supposed to look. Remember, you're not supposed to uh, excessively use. I don't want to damage my vision. I'm not ever going to turn this on. Coming from ThinkPads, I can say that this keyboard, this keyboard's really good. I also have a Dell XPS 9720, and it's keyboard's a lot shorter than this, shorter travel. This is really good. Really good, sturdy. No real flex. And it's a clicky trackpad. It's not a haptic, but that's okay. Ultra 7, E support. There's not too many buttons on the top. Lenovo Aura Edition. Now let's take a look at the ports. We have an HDMI 2.1, Thunderbolt 4, and we have a uh, headphone jack. 
On the other side, we have a Thunderbolt 4 and a USB-A, and this is the power. And this little switch turns the camera on and off. So this is the power switch. I wish it was recessed a bit. It is flat with the, the surface, so you may accidentally press that when you lift up your notebook. So again, we try to, oof, not good, don't do that. There we go, so turn it on. I also purchased the one year accidental warranty production. It was $30. This is all in Canadian dollars. I also paid $1,670 for this notebook. It comes with one terabyte of storage. It comes with um, 16 gigabytes of RAM and Windows 11 Pro. And and it doesn't turn on. Huh. Okay. Maybe it needs to be plugged into the wall. 